Hi everyone, Richard here with Curriculum Mapping for Google Workspace. Curriculum Mapping for Google Workspace is a highly customizable internal Google Workspace add-on that works with Google Drive, Google Docs, Google Sheets, Google Calendar, and Looker Studio. When we launch the Curriculum Mapping add-on, we'll notice in the About features of the add-on it gives you this option to consult a customized now Looker Studio dashboard for analyzing curriculum data and report generation. So that's what we're going to explore in this video. So I'm going to go right to my dashboard. And right off the bat, we can easily filter and get to any unit in our curriculum. And we can see uh, when they're happening, what course they belong to, what subject area, even what apps are being used, as well as um, a quick access link to a resource folder, and then of course a link directly to the unit planner itself, which is also built in uh, Google Docs. Um, if we launch the add-on while in Google Docs, um, it will recognize right away that this is a unit that is in our map, and it gives us again that same data that we saw in that dashboard except here we can update the dates and even the teacher of record if need be if there's turnover we also have a link to our resource folder here which will pop out directly right here uh, we get our list of technology apps once this finishes refreshing okay so we get our list of the apps that are being used in this unit and we can also view any of the attached outcomes or standards. So in this particular case, I'd like to add a few of the ISTE standards to this unit. And the way that would work is I simply would select uh, the ISTE button from here. And then I can proceed to select which of these outcomes or, or which of these standards are being addressed uh, in this unit. So I'm just going to select so I can memorize these easily, just the first four of Empowered Learner. All right, those are selected. I'm going to hit Submit. What this will do is uh, place those standards into uh, our map. And let's go back to our dashboard. And I'm going to refresh the data. And now if I go to uh, page two, and if I go into my wellness course that we were just looking at, um, I can see that the standards that I've attributed to that unit uh, now appear as part of the searchable outcome. So this is really powerful in the fact that globally I can select a specific standard. So if I want to look at my ISTE standards and I see where is EL1C being addressed, it's a one click and it tells me right away which subject areas, which class, which grade levels, when during the year um, this is being addressed. Um, and if we're interested in finding out gaps, well, uh, we could quickly find those out by anything that is missing from this list. Because if it's missing from this drop-down list, it means it's not being documented or tracked anywhere in your curriculum. So there you have it. So it's a very powerful way to go directly from Google Docs to a centralized uh, dashboard of reporting and managing uh, standards in your curriculum. Thanks for watching. Bye.